What's up guys, welcome to new Unreal Engine 5 tutorial. Today I am going to show you how to change the tiling of a material. It's going to be a very easy video to follow, so let's get started. Alright, so by changing the tiling of a material, we can change basically the scale and we can make it look a bit nicer with our mesh or landscape in this case. So to start fresh, let me right click in the content browser and create a new material. Let's call it something as M underscore test and let me open this material up. All right, so the first thing that I need to do is basically drop down some textures. In my case, I have some mega scans uh, surfaces. So let me go ahead and open this one and drag in this two little textures, okay? Which is basically the base color itself, right? Which will give the color. And then the normal to give it some bumps and make it a bit nicer. Uh, now, I also recently made a video showcasing the displacement in Unreal Engine 5.4, which you can see it adds like little hills into it, and it's so cool. So, also, I recommend to check that out. But anyway, that's not the focus of this video. The focus of this video is to change the tiling. So, now what we can do is basically plug in the RGB directly to the base color and the RGB of the normal to the, of course, normal. And now, if I apply and to save, we have this simple material. I can select my landscape, go down, and drag in this new M test material into the landscape material. And boom, there you go. Now, the landscape has the texture, but the problem is that it is too small, okay? As you can see, the grains of sand are too small and it doesn't look very, very, very good. So what we need to do is change the tiling and make it bigger. So let's go back to the material. And the way to do this is to get the UVs of our texture and do a texture coordinates, okay? So it's easier if we just type coordinates. And boom, we have this little node which allows us to change the UV tiling. So I can now also connect the same node to the UVs of the normal map. And then with this selected, we can change it from one to a lower value. And a lower value will mean that it's bigger. Normally 0.3 is a good value I have found for Quixel materials. So we put 0.3 in both of them and go boom. As you can see now, the material is indeed bigger. And we can do that again by going here and maybe even, you know, 0.1 and 0.1. And we can make it even bigger, right? And boom, now it is even bigger. And look at the difference of this. <laughs> it is so, so different and it looks way nicer and just way better. So that's how we go ahead and can change the tiling of a material to make it bigger or also smaller, of course, by going ahead and increasing that value. So that's it, guys. If I found this video helpful, I would really appreciate it. You can like the video and subscribe to my channel. I have lots of Unreal Engine 5 videos and tutorials, so check them out. Check out my Patreon YouTube members for many benefits. Follow me on my socials. And now, yes, with all said, bye bye.